again on this on the platform called systems where common sense is given to every woman lost cause um, my name is Tawo Kiedun and I'm here with a friend of mine, a good friend of mine at this time. His name is? So my name is Peter Isesele. I'm very excited to be here with Taiwo to just have, you know, a one-on-one friendly and uh, motivating Absolutely. conversation. Very excited to be here. Yeah, Peter is a coach and a mentor on Grad Nest um, Mentorship Program. Uh, is a mentor and a coach for every prospective graduate student in to Canada, different universities and colleges and institutions in Canada. And I'm sincerely telling you, we'll be deeply grateful if Peter is your mentor, as I've watched one of his programs. He's on YouTube, he's on um, Instagram, he's on Facebook, he's on uh, different type of social media platforms. And uh, you can search for him on the platform, on the social media. I think the name is Grad Nest Mentorship. Yeah, so on Facebook, you can contact me via um, just search Grad Nest Edu Mentorship on Facebook and then on on, Inst- on Facebook, my Facebook page, and then on okay. YouTube, Peter Sessele, on LinkedIn, Peter Sessele, on um, Instagram, Peter Sessele1. Yeah. Yeah, so we are on the platform this evening and at this time, um, we want to treat a very nice topic and it will be interactive an interactive section with the speaker on this platform a friend of mine and we want to create a purpose a driving compass for every woman on earth it's a very simple topic and uh, as we go on i will ask a few questions that i believe that everyone also has the kind of question in their heart and if you have anything you can comment you can put it on the comment section or you, if you ask any question if you have any question rather I believe that the speaker is always readily available to answer. Absolutely. So I will ask from my friend at the speaker at this time that what is purpose? What can you say about purpose? You know, so um, if you just check like the ordinary definition in the dictionary, you know, it will just talk about reason, right? The Absolutely. reason for a particular thing is the purpose of that thing. So that can divert into different aspects you know it can be the purpose of life the purpose of you know a particular car or the purpose of a particular plant so it's basically the reason for a thing why that thing is actually existing in the first place are you saying everything on earth visible let me say visible now that we can see with our naked eye actually have a reason why it exists if you cannot define anything to the role it performs or to what is what is its relevant in human existence or in nature and all that, then that thing doesn't hold any value. And anything you see today, even though even like in a garbage bin, you know, things that are now no longer in use, Absolutely. they were once useful. They were full Absolutely. of use. Now yes. they are now less use and you know then they are not being discarded yeah but everything can always be traced to the reason for why it was created or manufactured as this case may be okay um specifically we'll be treating human beings as uh, a purpose driven life now and i want to ask does every woman on earth has a purpose so the same thing we if you want to really understand that we have to really think about you know a manufacturer okay right there is no manufacturer that creates a, pro- a product without thinking of the intention behind that particular product absolutely it is the intention behind that product that actually drive the manufacturer you know they can have a preconceived reason in mind that will help in the type of design the thing will have in terms of the structure or some of the capacity that they are going to build into the car so everything definitely you know has a purpose and for every human being i would say every human being has a purpose because every human being was created and if every human being was created similar to what we know about manufacturing and all that if every human being was created then there should be a reason why a human being was created there is a specific need that need to be met that you were created to okay let me ask on that note every woman on earth does not believe that they come from a manufacturer does it really mean that everyone that does not believe that doesn't live on a purpose you know what 
if you don't believe that apple is a company it doesn't stop apple from being a company it doesn't remove that yes yeah, absolutely so even though you don't believe that if you, if i have a samsung phone and then they're telling me this is samsung phone and i say i don't believe it doesn't change that phone from being a samsung phone great right so if people are from the notion of you know um i came from you know depends on some people have this belief of their origin and all that so this that is their belief it doesn't change fact that is just what they've been is i think you always mention about preset belief right it's what they've come to learn and maybe people have told them about their then what they've learned in school read and things like that those are very fine but that could not be the fact okay so the fact is every human brain every human being was created that is the fact i got something now i want to ask a very simple question from as our audience follows there is um i always make a statement that every human being is not being born with a preset belief yeah we come into knowing or education by reconditioning or through experience mm-hmm. now you made mention of something now that that is what they have come to believe and i want to ask that purpose really is it what we have been taught or what the manufacturer as you've said actually had in, in mind for us you know um i always like to give practical examples okay that's good you know if a car is manufactured and then you know is actually maybe to you know for transportation purpose and all that and then you begin you begin to use that car for a different reason the car is not going to tell you no absolutely you know the car is not going to tell you no but that is not the original intention for which it was created so whether you know someone is you know fulfilling the purpose by by, for, um, for which he was created or he is doing something else you know it's there are systems in the world that when those particular systems and those principles i would say are obeyed then productivity and what people define success in quotes will still be achieved in the eyes of the person and in the eyes of the world wow thank you very much our speaker has made us to understand something at this point that um, whether we like it or not the intention of the manufacturer mm-hmm. still really exists. It okay. now depends on individual yes. products to discover the intention Absolutely. in the heart of the manufacturer. Absolutely. Absolutely. So it means that as we are watching us, um, whether you like it or not, you are designed for something. Absolutely. That means there's something we are designed for or plan to do on earth. 